continue. Ooh. Go, Miss Grant. Not sure if I will, though. I'm a loser. That's not correct. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Welcome to Black Hill. <laughs> Max Caulfield. He also has the biggest, biggest room. Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Is it the same thing on the board? I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. Man, people here are merciless. We all yes can. Jesus Christ, what a place is this? Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Oh God. Really? As if. Juliet, extreme reporter. Read this week's edition of the Black Wolf Totem, seriously? Well, I didn't understand the last two words. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. And again, we're missing... Forces. This girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. Totally 80s film night, Halloween party... Nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. At least that's an alarm from this century. <laughs> we get it, she's missing. Somebody has gone crazy with these posters. We learned in camps, campus observer following Tips for uh, your safety. Always be aware of your location. Always let friends know where you are, where you're going. And always report any incident immediately to the campus authorities. To download the free campus alert app. <laughs> Could really. be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. Geek Girls Book Club. <laughs> no boy wizards are said vampire fiction allowed. No boys, period. <laughs> Wait, wait a second. It was about Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around around here. Okay. Showers are wet. Don't be a zombie. They live. Social media has a time and place. Don't let life flash you by. Now that's true. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. Hmm. The universal symbol for please leave me alone, asshole. This is like the public DNA of our dorm. Don't let depression keep you down. Everybody gets sad and lonely. If you need somebody to talk to, please call us anytime day or night and we will be listening because we care. Statistics tutor wanted. Lost phone, diamond phone case, vortex club party. Please return to lost and found Prescott dormitory. Thank you. Made us still murder join the Blackwell Vegan Club. <laughs> no, thank you. Can you swim to success? 
Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. Neither change your wish to see Gandhi. Ah, shut up. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? This is your planet, and when it comes to protecting the environment, you're the boss. It's up to us to make a choice, so come raise your voice. Save the Earth. With boobies out. Okay. Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Mm. Obvious, but true. Why do I have the feeling that she is going for depression? Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And... Max, your principal, sent me an email saying that you told me some tales about a black pool honor student. Is this true? The principal said this was a serious false charge and that he is worried you're telling stories. Call me as episode we can talk about this. <laughs> and slipped in a $200 gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Never forget the day you were born and that your first smile was love at first sight. It's your special day. We miss you, but you're so proud that you're following your dreams. Love you, your mother and father. Wait a second. There was another. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? It's such a pretty guitar. I need to play it more. Era una robusta, mamma, della Norway. Era rimasto in fondo, stavo per buttarla via. Yep, definitely, she's depressed. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbirds. I haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. Yet. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. This action will have consequences. Everything has consequences in life, come on. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HDTV. Sticky note. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. There's my poor laptop begging me to check in. I look so pathetic. Daniel has so much talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. 
I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Lauren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. I shall never stop sending your messages of gratitude. Also, I have a rather eclectic collection of TV cult classics. Thank you for help. I'm a scientist more than an artist. Now, can you click to explain how, to me how a camera works? <laughs> Here's my go-to source for instant photo inspiration. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. You're depressed, honey. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Mm. Cartier-Bresson, Doineau, Hamilton, the greatest. I should hit the thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? I don't care. Music inspires me in my photography. It's the same music she... Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. So cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. to believe I'm 18. Do I look any older? Just more stressed. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. She did a lot of photos. I have to go to the other room, girl's room. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Ah, shit. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Ah. Juliet looks like she's ready to throw down. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. If you don't let me out, She's I your friend. Agree. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh... Uh... Juliet... Mason. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. Hey, I've watched Dana. So stupid. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. 
I didn't even think you knew my name at all. <laughs> uh, of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. If you don't let me out, How do you know? Victoria Chase. You know her. You could say that. But why would Dana go after your boyfriend? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary she won't answer saw. his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Well, let's go check it out, then. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs the out there. Your work is on Unlike me. State, and we appreciate your efforts and wish you success in future endeavors. She is an idiot. Uh, Gazette. Tablet. Or camera. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. I hate you, Victoria. No, officer, I'm not snooping. Just admiring Victoria. Cutting edge technology. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I will join her posse. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. No. Missing person. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Why? That's real nice, Victoria. And who the hell thinks I'm a hipster? Boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. What a bitch. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Speaking of selfies. Nah, I'm not gonna leave, do nothing. Just leave everything as it is. I don't care about what's going to happen. Don't let her understand Ugh. something is wrong. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what <laughs> Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Almost done. Get the flash drive, and then I'll go see Warren. That looks like a home pregnancy test. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. Dana really does look stressed about all this. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. That's and to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. 
I gotcha. Well, he probably has a crush. It would be a cool sticker without the words. Yes, it's a great game. I love it too. This is both sad a stream, and you. pathetic. I thought I should write this so you might not hate my dumb as forever. I know I act like a tough sock around everybody, but I never hurt around you. I'm another kind of man you deserve. You saw how I pussed out. If you need any money, let me know. Let's make something stupid. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. Okay, I'm not gonna pick it up. Well, thank you for the follow. Clinic note. I assume Dana kept the appointment. Let's see, just a little tiny bit. Thank you, YouTuber, for the subscription to the channel. I don't know how is the doctor's appointment. Well, basically. Dana is probably pregnant with somebody. I can't even imagine what life would be like could being be a cheerleader. Could be her boyfriend or could not. Dramatic, I guess. Why does she want to keep it a secret? 